My name is Colton and today we're going to talk about how much copper there is in an electric vehicle. Copper is one of the oldest known metals in the world. It's been used in jewelry and currencies for centuries, but more recently it's become increasingly important as the world shifts from a carbon-based economy to a low carbon economy. This shift requires renewable resources like wind and solar. Due to copper's exceptional conductivity, it's essential for energy storage and transmission. And as we've already seen with automobile makers like Tesla and GM, car companies are moving towards the electric vehicle model, which is going to require copper, and it's going to require a lot. How much exactly? Well, let's consider a standard internal combustion engine car. The average amount of copper needed to make one of those cars is about 48 pounds. A hybrid vehicle is about 88 pounds of copper. And finally, a fully electric vehicle like a Tesla requires about 183 pounds of copper. So what does this mean? Well, we're gonna need a lot of copper and companies that are mining or exploring for copper are primed for success due to the increased demand. So for example, a company like Core Assets would provide investors an early opportunity to get in with a company that's poised for success. We'll provide more information about Core Assets in the description below. The ticker symbol is CC. And remember, like and subscribe for more content and to never miss an update.